Hey guys, William Petty here with Centrifuge Training. Going to talk to you about the new 1000 Lumen X300 Ultra. One of the things we are constantly hearing on the range is that there is such a thing as too much white light. Uh, when we get into weapon mounted lights, this is simply not the case. There is a direct correlation between the amount of lumen output that translates directly to how much information we're processing. So lumens equals information. With that information, we then problem solve. Problem solving can be divided into various tasks, IDing threats, searching, navigating, communicating, all that good stuff. But what we're looking at is, is that the white light is a substitution for the sun, right? So I jokingly tell guys like, hey, unless your white light is brighter than the sun, you still need more light. Weapon mounted lights are an essential part for any defensive handgun. The reason for that is it allows us to put two hands on the gun. That has a direct correlation to how well we are neutralizing that threat or how quickly we're neutralizing that threat. A weapon mounted light directly helped me in one of my officer involved shootings. The reason is that it allowed me to get two hands on the gun, track a threat that was mobile, and also reduce the split time, thereby reducing the overall engagement time. Also, post-engagement, after the shooting was done, having a weapon mount of light on the gun that's on allows me to break this hand free and start working radios and other tasks without deriving the light from um, being moved on the threat. If you have the ability to run a weapon mount of light, you should. The pros are many and the cons are, in my mind, zero. It's a tool that is readily available that allows shooters to be more accurate on the gun, track mobile threats, break free, a multitask with a support hand while lighting either an unknown or a known threat. The reason I have an X300 Ultra on my duty weapon when I go to work uh, is I believe it is the finest weapon amount of light on the market.